Oh, hey. Oh, this guy? Don't worry about this guy. What up, Squatchers? I know this is long overdue, and you guys have been not hearing from me for a while. I've been super busy with a ton of projects. I kind of I kind of overdid it myself. Uh, been working on the house. As you can see, I've got my bed in the living room. I've got construction going on all over the place. I've got this guy I just had surgery on my hand. Uh, well, my finger really. Uh, they did some corrective surgery to fix my finger. So hopefully that'll work itself out, I guess. I don't know. But I've been doing a lot of house remodeling. We've got, oh, we've got a lot done. Oh, let me show you. So yeah, like I said, bedroom and the living room. Um, kind of started out here and then had to stop because we found a leak in our bathroom. So we just went ahead and stopped and started our bathroom. So we got new floors coming in. We've got the walls taped, floated, painted, textured, all that good stuff. Um, goes really good with the new floors I'm putting in. I've got a sink in over here. I've got another sink coming in over here. And so this is what we've got done so far over the holidays and all that good stuff. So I've been really busy, you know, not only just working, but also working here at my house it's been kind of annoying that we've been sleeping in the the living room and stuff and not having our bed bedroom so yeah i've been kind of hectic around here lately kind of overdid it with the projects which brings me to my next update on the uh toyota so because of my hand and everything that I've got going on here, I kind of decided that with the Toyota engine, um, I'm not gonna do it myself. I went ahead and had Precision R start putting it together for me. I've got some pictures, which hopefully I'll put somewhere right here, somewhere right here. I don't know, I'll figure it out in editing. So hopefully, um, he should have that. The only thing we're missing is the injectors and the injector pump, which he's getting shipped out of Australia. So that should be here in a couple weeks and then he can finish putting the engine together. And when I get my engine back, I won't be able to do any rebuild with you guys because obviously he did it all. But at least it'll be ready. We can just pull the old engine, stab the new one, get everything good to go, get it all run in and I can have my truck back so super excited about that um that's should be within a few weeks it should be ready and we can start pulling out the old one cleaning up the engine compartment and putting the new one in so can't wait for that the other thing is that like, we did buy a, another Toyota pickup and we bought a newer one we got a 2017 Toyota pickup the TRD Sport so we got that for her traded in her her Fufu Jeep Renegade and got her a Toyota pickup as well. So now we have two Toyota pickups. Um, so we did that over, actually we did that for my birthday right before Christmas. So that was kind of cool. Uh, let's see what else, what else, what else, what else? Uh, as soon as we get my engine in, we we get all that done and we can start working on, on aesthetics like suspension, tires, interior, exterior, all that good stuff, paint job. Um, that'll kind of just slowly, hopefully fall into place. As far as the Grom, the, uh, Grom, I think I'm pretty much done working on it. I've got the Grom pretty much where I want everything. Um, so I don't think I'm going to be doing any more work to it, except for maybe a seat. I think, um, uh, a seat is really all I'm probably going to get for it. I pretty much got it where I want it until the engine blows then we can do maybe some cool stuff with the engine but for now I think I'm just going to ride it and work on my stunt game getting getting my willies down getting you know getting all the stunts perfected so I don't look like an idiot while I'm riding around on a little bitty motorcycle but uh so so the ground is pretty much done I think I think I've, you know, I've got it to where I pretty much envisioned it. So the next thing is going to be the Toyota, getting the Toyota, uh, getting the diesel dropped into it. And then, oh, June's coming up. So we've got Mudfest coming up. 
So we'll probably uh, be working on the blazer a little bit too. I know it's got a U-joint out on the uh, front axle. So we'll be replacing the U-joint -joint on there. And then it's also not sure if the throttle cables are sticking or if it's actually in the throttle body. But uh, we'll take a look at that and get the blazer up and running. We're probably going to also cut off the fenders because the tires are rubbing and it's eating up our tires. So we'll probably get the fenders cut. I think I think we're just going to do an easy kind of cut on those fenders which I know you guys are probably gonna rip me for because you know it's a classic and I'm gonna tear it up but anyways that's my mud truck so I really don't care about that truck so we'll probably uh probably get the fenders cut oh we got some uh we got some light bars for it so we'll install some uh light bars on there we got we're gonna do the fenders um so yeah hopefully mud fest hopefully this year I'll do better on getting some uh, footage from Mudfest uh, last year was kind of I mean I, I that was my fault I just wasn't experienced enough on how to be able to enjoy my time there and get footage at the same time so hopefully this year uh, I can do a little better and uh, we'll get some better footage and some better content uh, for the channel so I think that about wraps it up uh, for what I've got for you guys so upcoming like i said uh stepping up the stunt game and all that stuff my hands should be healed in about a month or two um which is great because i'm going on vacation um i don't know if you guys want to see anything like that on my channel i, I really don't think so because i'm going to try to keep it mostly mechanical stuff and the stuff that i'm doing you know with my channel i'm going to try to keep it you know i'm not going to try to throw a bunch of life story bunch of crap on you guys so um, I'm gonna try to keep it kind of together and focused on the uh, mechanical part of everything and the uh, you know having fun with everything that I work on so that'll be fun um, so upcoming the Toyota hopefully that'll be done before summer gets here because um, I'd really like to get that together and get an AC system installed with that thing so I can uh, I can be rocking for the summer and then the Grom, I'm just going to be working on my stunt game and then uh, getting the blazer ready for Mudfest and then hopefully, hopefully also finishing up my house. So a lot of projects going on at once. Um, so hang in there guys with my, uh, my channel. I'm going to try to get to you guys as much as I possibly can and uh, we'll go from there. So I will see you guys in the next one. <laughs>